Hey everyone, welcome to Garden Fork. Today, the special episode, grilled corn. It's the summer and we make a lot of corn and we grill it and there seems to be, some people have different theories about how to make your corn. People soak it, people don't soak it. Martha Stewart says soak it for an hour. My neighbors say you soak it overnight and I say you don't need to soak it at all. So I figured, why don't we just try three ways and see what happens. Okay, so we've got our coals here with our chimney starter. That thing came out. That thing. I never seem to make enough charcoal, but that'll be enough for our test. Okay, we have corn that's been soaking for all day and then an hour and then an unsoaked piece of corn. This has been soaking for since yesterday. And we have to figure out a way to tell uh, tell these all apart. So I figured I'd just put little hash marks in here. So this is the one that's been soaking the longest, so I'm gonna put three lines in it. This one's been soaking for a little more than an hour. So that'll have two marks in it. And then there's one which hasn't been soaking. It's just corn. No, you know, I'm not, some people say they have to open the husk up and tear the silk off and then rewrap it. I just think that's a pain. That's I mean, work. it's too much work. You know, it's all about simple. All right, this goes on like that. I wonder if I need more charcoal in that. You know, you can also just eat corn uncooked or raw, like raw food. Need some butter with that? No, it tastes great. It's really good. So you don't even have to cook your corn. I mean. How's that for simple? Show's over. <laughs> yeah, thanks for watching. Send us an email. <laughs> More raw food. I'm just gonna reject this. All the dogs eat raw food. Yeah, see, that can just get like that, and you turn them. See, this guy isn't nearly as done, and neither is that guy. I think I don't have enough fire in the coals here. How's it cooking? It's cooking okay, but I had this idea that it's basically the corn is wrapped in itself. It's in itself. It's like it's kind of like wrapped in an insulating material almost. So what if we just stuck them straight on the coals? You know? That might really show kind of the difference between the, the soaked ones and the not soaked ones. So at this point, how long have they been cooking about? Well, about 10 minutes. Oh, that's catching on fire. That's a bad thing. <laughs> okay, that's not gonna work. But the really wet corn- Is not catching on it's fire. It's not catching on fire. <laughs> we're gonna take the wet ones and stick them on here. And we're gonna cut the one, and we're gonna put that in the edge, like that. I feel like this shouldn't be unattended anymore. I'll be here. Yeah. Like I said. <laughs> Is that going to taste like a burnt marshmallow? No. I kind of like, you know, burnt corn. So is it charred? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing, huh? Likewise. This is which one? Uh, number three. It's kind of hot. It's been sitting on coals. This is the one that hasn't been soaked. Oh, and see, this has... <laughs> I like the burn. All right, here we go. We have our three corns. This was the overnight soak, one hour soak, and no soak. And first we put them on the grill. And you know, the coals aren't doing really well. Get out of there. Then I put them in the grill. And then we put them in the grill. Uh, and that worked better. But I, th you know, if you're cooking food and you want to grill your corn, you can put it right on the grate. It's just going to have to do it a little earlier. So I just like to take butter and I literally just kind of undo the thing and I just roll it right on. This is the soaked one and it's really underwhelming. It's coming out of your mouth. Sorry. This is the soaked one, and it's really underwhelming. 
Okay, this is the one hour soak. And that's better. This is the one that we did not soak. A little bit of butter on there. A little bit of salt. Maybe you're not in the mood for corn. No, this is good. Oh. <laughs> this is much better than the, than the watered ones. So far you like the raw the best. This is the best. Because it has a little burnt caramelization on it. Uh -huh. A little bit of smokiness. Uh-huh. This is the winner, okay? I don't believe in the soaking thing now. I'm 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 never gonna even think about that ever again. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>